Hi, I'm Ashoka Rishala, Assistant Professor of Chemistry, Abhidya Government College, Hanam. Today, we are going to discuss about uh, CPZ 2023 Chemistry Syllabus as well as Question Paper Analysis. And what are the things we have to focus? And uh, what is the weightage of the different questions? in the uh, uh, CPZ 2023 that we will discuss. And uh, this uh, is uh, more useful. I think uh, it is more useful uh, those who are preparing for MSc chemistry as well as biochemistry, genetics, biotechnology, and environmental sciences. Let us see how, what is the uh, syllabus and how the questions are framed and what are the chapters and the different weightage? Let us see. See this uh, CPZ 2022 syllabus and question paper analysis. And um, I have told you, I'm Ashok Alishala, student professor of chemistry, Kakatiya Government College. See, the syllabus of uh, MSc chemistry or MSc biochemistry, environmental science, and uh, forensic science, as well as the biotechnology contain part A and part B. In case of part A, and this is common for all the students who are preparing for uh, what, I, what I mean, say, MSc Chemistry, as well as MSc Biochemistry, MSc Forensic Science, MSc Environmental Science, MSc Biotechnology. The part A, it consists of 40 marks. What are the different topics uh, in the inorganic chemistry? We have coordination compounds, application of coordination compounds, Organometallic chemistry, metal carbonyls, and related compounds, bioinorganic chemistry, HSCAP, that is hard and soft acids and bases. Whereas in the organic chemistry, we have carboxylic acids and derivatives, synthesis based on the carbonion, nitrohydrocarbons, amines, cyanides, isocyanides, heterocyclic compounds, carbohydrates, amino acids, and proteins. Whereas in physical chemistry, we have electrochemistry and EMF, chemical kinetics, thermodynamics, and photochemistry. And part B, that is only for MSc chemistry. And this consists of E block elements, chemistry of zero group elements, chemistry of D block elements, chemistry of A block, general principles of inorganic qualitative analysis, chemical bonding, molecular orbital theory, theory of uh, quantitative analysis. Theories of bonding in metals, structural theory. Okay, all these are from inorganic chemistry. And structural theory of organic chemistry, acyclic hydrocarbons, ally cyclic hydrocarbons, aromatic hydrocarbons, and halogen compounds, alcohols, phenols, ethers and epoxides, carbonyl compounds, conformation and analysis, stereochemistry of carbon compounds. Atomic structure, these up to here, these are included in the organic chemistry. Atomic structure, elementary quantum mechanics, gaseous state, liquid state, solutions, dilute solution, colligative properties, and uh, uh, solid state chemistry, uh, gaseous, okay, colligative properties, solid state chemistry, phase rule, colloids and surface chemistry, and uh, adsorption. Evaluation, evaluation of analytical data, these are included in part B. Part B only for MSc chemistry students. Part A and part B is completely for MSc chemistry. Whereas part A syllabus is only for uh, only those people who are writing the other uh, or like uh, MSc biochemistry, environmental science, forensic science, biotechnology. And, low, and so on. I will explain that also. See, the question paper pattern. 
the entrance test uh, in all the subjects will be 90 minutes is the duration and 100 objective multiple choice questions. And that the entrance test will be considered of three or four varieties of objective type items such as analogous, classification, matching, comprehension of research study, experiment, theoretical point of view, etc. with multiple answers besides the usual multiple items. That means uh, some uh, multiple choice are there. The item will be framed only from the syllabus that is given in the uh, prescribed syllabus that is will be in the entrance test. Pattern of entrance test for admission into MSc, Biochemistry and Environmental Science, Forensic Science, Genetics, Microbiology, and these candidates should appear for common interest test that is namely BCE, SF, SG, and M, comprising of 40 A, that is chemistry includes 40 marks. And part B consists of one of the optional subjects that is in BSc level, such as physics, botany, geology, genetics, microbiology, biochemistry for other 60 marks. And uh, if you see, uh, pattern in the entrance test for uh, bio, uh, MSc Biotechnology, it is comprising of part A is chemistry fully 40 marks and part B consists of biotechnology. And this what is the pattern of the examination that is CPZ 2023. Now let us see MSc Chemistry uh, uh, <clears throat> question paper analysis. In this, and we know that there are 100 multiple choice questions among them it was given inorganic chemistry, there are 35 questions are given from inorganic chemistry. And from organic chemistry, there are 29 questions are given. From the physical chemistry, and there are 30 questions are given. And if you see the spectrum, that is either organic spectra or physical spectra, we have the six questions. And among these six questions, from organic spectra, there are uh, three, that is like NMR, MOS spectra, and uh, that is in physical chemistry, we have the three questions, that is, uh, what do you say, rotational spectrum, vibrational spectrum, like that, uh, we got uh, uh, three questions. Now, if you see the other one, in entire uh, 100 questions, the problems are only seven, that means, there is no student to uh, uh, by PC to by BJC students or any other student. There is no worry about the problematic. Simply, there are only seven problems are given. That means you can expect that in even 2023 also about this range. That means six to eight questions may be the problematic questions. Remaining are all our theoretical based questions. Among them, from the inorganic chemistry, we have only one question. That is mainly the coordination problem. What type of the question? That is calculation of the CMS, crystal field stabilization energy. Whereas in the physical chemistry, we have the five questions. That is from electrochemistry, it has one. From the kinetics, there will be one question, two questions. From the solutions, one question. From the solid state, one question. In solutions also, uh, more about uh, in uh, colligative properties, we get this type of question. And uh, See, from the spectra, there is one question that was given from the rotational spectrum. Let us see what are the questions that was given in 40, I told you, in 48, 40 questions. And that is very important for getting the scores for uh, MSc Biochemistry, Genetics, Environmental Chemistry, uh, Forensic Science, Biochemistry, even uh, MSc Biotechnology. This includes from the among these 40 questions, in organic chemistry, it was given 14 questions. And from organic chemistry, it was 10 questions. From the physical chemistry, there are 10 questions. And the remaining from the spectra, all the six problems just now I told you, all these are only from the, uh, what I mean to say, in part A only. That means you have to look for these six questions from the part A. Uh, and of course, part B also they may contain, but uh, in the CPZ 2022, there is no question from the spectrum part in part B, but uh, all these are included in part A. That is from organic three, 
and in physical chemistry. This is the a simple pattern that is uh, uh, given in CPZ 2023. And we will again come back with uh, uh, the different question that was given in organic chemistry, physical or in a, inorganic chemistry and physical chemistry in 2022 in the next video i will give you the basic concept of each, each question as well as the how to answer the uh, for the different kind of questions okay this is uh, what is our uh, uh, syllabus of uh, msc chemistry uh, cpz 2023 okay thank you for watching this video and share among your friends uh, if you like, um, if you <clears throat> if you're interested, you can uh, send it to your friends also, and uh, we'll, uh, I will share uh, another video uh, soon for uh, which consists of uh, uh, questions, uh, different questions from CPZ 2022 with answers and basic parts. Okay. Mm.